Hi guys, this is Megha Verma. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to design this web banner in Corel Draw. So without any delay, let's get started. So this is the size of our web banner, 1000 pixel by 320 pixels. Now first we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a rectangle. Now we will set the size of the rectangle 1000 by 320 pixels. Now we will set the align of the rectangle. First we will click on specified point then align center horizontally and align center vertically. Now we will select this rectangle and we will select the interactive fill tool from the toolbar. Now we will select fountain fill, then elliptical fountain fill. Now we will set the colors. Now we will adjust the fountain fill like this. Now we will select this rectangle and we will drag like this and right click to make a copy. Now we will right click and we will select convert to curve. Now we will select the shape tool from the toolbar. Now we will remove this node by double click. Now we will adjust the shape. Now we will click on this line. Now we will select convert to curve. Now we will adjust the handles. Now we'll remove the outline by right click. Now we'll select this shape and we will select interactive fill tool and we will apply like this. Now we will set the colors. You can see the color code. Now we have all these details and image. Now first we will select the image. Now we will click on mirror horizontally to flip the image. Now we will increase the size of the image. Now we will go to the effects menu and we will select creative. Now we will select vignette option. Now we will click on ok. Now we will adjust the size. Now we will right click and we will select power clip inside. Now we will click on this rectangle. Now again we will adjust the elliptical fountain fill. Now we have all these details in all places. First you can see the font style of all the text. Now first we will place the logo. Now we will change the color. We will give a white color. We will select this text and we will click. Now we will select one by one and we will change the color.
Now we'll select the rectangle tool and we will draw a small rectangle. Now we'll select the round corner option. Now we'll select shape tool and we will round the corners. Now we'll change the color and we will remove the outline. Now we'll adjust the size. Now we'll select and drag and right click to make a copy. Now we'll select this and we will go to effects menu. Now we'll select blur then we will select cushion blur. Now we'll adjust the radius. Now we'll click on OK. Now we'll select this shape and we will go to the edit menu and we will select copy properties from. Now we'll click on fill then OK. Now we'll copy the properties from this rectangle. Now we'll adjust the interactive fill tool. Now we'll select both and we will press C and E to align center. Now we'll place this text. Now we'll change the color. Now we'll place the web cell and we will change the color. Now we'll select this and we'll press the line center so guys our web banner design is ready i hope you like the design if you have any question regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box please like share and comment and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos thanks for watching